Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Sharnice, and welcome to Simply Nikla. After realizing that it's almost the 4th of July, I knew I had to make some 4th of July nails for this video this week. It's pretty crazy how this year is passing by so fast. It's like it's already half a year already gone. Bam gone and it's crazy how it's already the 4th of July already up this weekend and I, I love the 4th of July I love the fireworks but like gosh this year has been flying by pretty darn quick so if you're ready for some red white and blue and to see how I do these quick and easy 4th of July nails sit back relax and continue watching but before you do it and you haven't already go down below and subscribe to my YouTube channel also all you guys give this video a like I really appreciate it sometimes throughout this video but other than that let's get started with this video to begin this nail tutorial you're gonna have to start with some base nail colors obviously like I always do and so for the ring finger and the middle finger we're gonna start off with just one coat of this nice like skin tone flesh tone color and the color I chose was from Sally Hansen and it is called Camelot and I lightly applied one coat onto both of those nails and then on the index finger, pinky, and the thumb, I wanted to apply this translucent pink that I made myself with just some clear nail polish and a dab of red and white nail polish to make this nice translucent pink to apply onto the nails for a base coat to make it more look like your natural nail pink base color. So the ring finger and the middle finger is going to have this one color ombre so it's just fading from darkness to this just fading out so the color that i chose to fade out is a blue and this blue is from la colors color craze and it's their gel glow and it's called underworld so i got a makeup sponge wedge i applied it onto the makeup sponge wedge about halfway down and kind of like fade it out even onto the makeup sponge wedge as you see here and then to just dab it onto the nail make sure it's fading it out and I did about two to three dab sessions to make them opaque but then it didn't allow me to have a darker tip to make it have that ombre of dark to light so I went in with this the regular brush from the nail polish bottle and then applied it right on to the tip section of the nail and I did about two coats to really make sure it's nice and opaque I used the edge of the makeup sponge wedge to kind of blend it out as well so it's not like a harsh line I left those two nails alone to dry now for the design on the other three nails the index finger pinky and thumb we're going to do some red and white stripes we are going to start with the white so the white that I used for these stripes was the LA Colors Color Craze and that one is called Energy Source. I then just went halfway up to the nail where I want the white to be really opaque and then I wiped some of that nail polish off and then brush, shaggy brushed, that's how I can explain it, shaggy brushed it up towards the cuticle area to make it look but also like scratchy and it has like this ombre effect as well so I did that to the white but make sure to have a space in between for the red section and then I went in with the red and did the same exact thing and the red that I used was from LA Colors Color Craze and that is called Hot Blooded. I did go in with two coats so the next coat you just going to want to leave the shaggy part that you did left alone and then start off right in the, the middle section where you want the stripe to be opaque and fill that in a couple of times. <laughs> To give that 4th of July feel, you definitely gonna need some stars for this nail design. So on the ring finger and the middle finger, I decided to go in with some white. And the white that I used was from LA Colors Color Craze and it is called Energy Source. And I, with a lighter brush, I just draw about three stars on each nail. <laughs> small dialing tool with that same white to apply some little tiny dots to represent more stars. The 
this last little thing I thought this nail set should have is some glitter and I decided to apply some glitter onto the white stripes so the glitter that I chose to use was from LA Colors Mermaid Magic and this one is called crystals and I applied that with that flat nail brush so it's not so packed full onto the white sections on the stripes <music> Okay, so now only thing that's left to do is to apply a top coat. So the top coat that I chose to use today was the Profix Quick Dry High Gloss Top Coat and I applied that onto all of the nails. <laughs> This is how my 4th of July nails came out this year. I really love them and like I just can't stop looking at them and I just love how I designed these nails this time and I think these are so cool and it, this is really quick and easy if you want to try it yourself and I just really love them okay so thank you so much for watching this video and I hope you have a great 4th of July and I hope you try these 4th of July nails out for yourself and if you like these nails go down below and give me a like as well subscribe if you haven't already and you like nail stuff subscribe you don't want to miss out so thank you so much for watching and i'll catch you back next week with another cool video bye